Hey, Craig McCram here, and today I have something from GalaxyCon. Um, my last video, I had a mystery box I wasn't too happy with. So I figured, you know what? Let me open up this one first. Maybe I'll merge both of the videos um, together into what you're going to see after this. Now, this is what I ordered at GalaxyCon. I ordered this for my birthday in the January. Um, I love monster movies. I love the Universal monster movies. Um, and absolute favorite. I know I'm in the minority here, but I love the w original Wolfman. Um, I also love Bella Lugosi. And um, this one is actually one that I showed my little girl. All right, got this from GalaxyCon. Should be. See how I'm gonna open this up without messing it up. So far, everything's packaged pretty well. Of course, this is the one time I didn't bring my pen. All right, let's see. Yeah, very packaged pretty well. I'm impressed. Before I got something from GalaxyCon, and it wasn't packaged bad, but not a lot of care was taken into it. So this is mine. All right. Let's see how this bad boy looks. Pretty good. I'm excited with this. So this is Rico Browning, who played the, the creature from the Black Lagoon. And I got him signed right in here. Got his signature, and also he wrote The Creature, which is exactly what I wanted. If you look in the back right there, um, that's exactly what I asked him to do. So yeah, I like this. This is definitely going to go framed. I already have an idea where that's going to go. What is the size? 11 by 17. Good. So, yeah. Love this. Signed by the creature. He played the creature in all the swimming scenes. Which, let's face it, are the majority of the scenes, right? There's, If you've never seen this movie, there's tons of scenes where you're just swimming around and whatnot. Um, me and my little girl have already watched this. So, it's going to be pretty cool to put this up. Very colorful, too. This looks a lot better in person. I love the green and the blue together. Definitely pretty good. All right, so I'm happy with this purchase. I'll tell you what. I definitely would buy something to get from GalaxyCon, especially seeing the way it was framed and everything else. Um, you had the option to make it Beckett authenticated or whatnot, but I I'm keeping this. I'm not selling this. Uh, speaking of selling, though, um, if you've seen what I got in the OC dugout box, willing to get rid of that stuff those things are up for trade so with that being said this is Kramer Kram and I to the loop hey guys Kramer Kram here and today I have one thing I know that it is and one thing that I don't know what it is so let's see what we got going on um, let's open up the one that I know what it is um, first let's see exactly how I'm gonna go about doing this um, I want to kind of be gentle on this bad boy. You know what? Let me start off on this side. Boy, this tape. You know what? Let me just, I kind of just rip that bad boy open the old fashioned way. Yeah. I think I'm just going to rip this bad boy on open. It's been a little while since I did something like that. You know what? Screw it. We'll use the knife later, huh? All right, let's see what we got in here. I know what it is, but you guys don't. Nice boxing material. And, oh yeah, this is nice. This is, guys. I don't know if you can see that. That's Tom Holland. The current Spider-Man. Tom Holland. Take this out so you guys can see it a little bit better. Oh, this is a nice picture. Look at that Tom Holland. Very nice picture. Obviously, this is from his first one. So I got that from a guy that I trust, trusted sailor on eBay. I don't recommend ever going on eBay, but whenever you do, do your research. 
find somebody that's known in the community, and you can walk up with a good looking eight by ten Tom Holland. Got a really good deal on that. Not too good though. That's one way you can tell on eBay. If the price is too good, it's fake. All right. Now this right here is an OC dugout box that I saw certain people getting, and I said, you know what? Let me try one of those bad boys. Now, it's a Hollywood box. I did get a Hollywood uh, box before from OC Cele Celebrity Marketing. And I'm trying to remember what was in it. I wasn't too ecstatic about that. That was one of their misses. I think what I got on that one was uh, the Cousin Eddie, Randy Quaid, um, the I Dream of Genie Pop, which I wasn't even supposed to get a pop. And uh, what else did I get? Something else that I was just not too hot on. Um, oh, Deuce Bigelow. Yeah. I was like, oh, not too hot on this. Oh, I like this. It gave me a little business card here. Doesn't sound like we have anything. Got a little business card. All right. So it's the OC Celebrity Marketing. Now, not OC Celebrity Working, my fault. That was the last one. This is the OC Dugouts Red Carpet Autograph Mystery Box. So, I've seen some of these. And some of them were really good. And then some of them made you pause. I'm hoping we can get something good out of here. If I can get one good thing out of here, I will be a happy camper. We shall see. I don't think I'm going to pull another Tom Holland out of here. But I did see some hits. All right. So let's see what we get out of here. Okay. So got some of that. Well, it looks like everything else is packaged again in this. So I'll tell you one thing. The packaging is really good on this bad boy. Some bubble wrap. Give that to the wife. She loves that crap. And we have it in here, some things. All right, let's pull it on out. See what's going on. All right, so I see I got one big thing, I got some small things, so let's open up on the smaller ones first. <laughs> this is hilarious. Wayne Newton, AKA the villain of Vegas Vacation. So Wayne Newton. This is pretty damn funny. Wayne Newton. So I would say that's a, hmm? Really? See, that's what you think about these celebrity boxes. You never know what the hell you're going to get. All right. I got a chick from Baywatch. Donica DeErico. I mean, red-blooded male. Grew up in the 90s. Of course, watched Baywatch. But, Baywatch... So I'm really, I'm really hoping that this last one gives me something. All right. All right. From the time machine, Rod Taylor. I'm pretty sure this is a time machine. It says H.G. Wells on it. So that's pretty cool. I think pretty much all of these things will be uh, up for trade. It's all Beckett Authenticated stuff. So, yeah. Check that out. Definitely don't know if I'm going back to OG um, dugout, but uh, yeah. To the loo.